Hello everyone, welcome back to Traffic Table channel. Today I'm gonna show you how to make a unicorn dot marker activity book on Gravit Designer. Are you ready? Let's get started. So I wanted to make a coloring book for unicorn, but I found there's a very very huge competition, and you know unicorn is like all the kids, all the teenager, all the people like unicorn. So it's always competitive and it's all so so profitable. So what you can do is you can niche down. So now nowadays dot marker activity book is also famous and trend right now. So what I did now is to make a unicorn dot marker activity book at the same time. And when I go there I found it's only one thousand results. That means the competition is not high as unicorn coloring book. Okay, so if you wrote, if you write unicorn dot, dot marker activity book, you will find one sound results, which is pretty okay for a competition related to unicorn. And as we can see here, there are pretty nice, awesome designs of dot marker activity book with a very very low PSR, as you can see here. And of course, it's very profitable. Let's go and look inside this one one kind of these books. So one of these books, as you can see here, inside, uh, we can go just down and it's really really not that hard to make something like that you can just find these pictures from bixby from any websites that have free public domain and if you want to to go to find free public domain sites you have uh, like two videos in my channel i i'm sure there are two videos yeah in my channel like there are six and six 12 different website designs you can find a public domain image for free there are videos on my channel you can go and check that and also you can just go for bixby for this video i will go for bixby and i will show you how can you make exactly like how can you bring the picture how can you make the design on graphic designer and how can make also the dot marker so let's get started so first of all we will go to graphic designer which is totally for free it's yeah it has a paid version of course pro but you can just go for it and it's totally for free and online okay so you will write graphic designer with v okay and then or you can write just www.designer.io and here we go you will say welcome for thank you for choosing graphic designer what you're gonna do is create a free account you will put your username and your uh, maybe your email address and also your password and then you repeat your password and then you will they will send you an email you will have to confirm your email so make a confirmation email first and then you will ready to go to have a new account and once you have a new account you will just go on the website itself and let's you will see this interface and let's go for new design okay and once you are here just convert the pixel to inches and uh, normally we make it six times nine inches as a coloring book and we wanted no bleed i will show you how to make it also no bleed so please focus so six times nine inches so don't forget to change that to inches not pixel because it normally it's pixel new design and then create cool what we're gonna do now is to make the border here to make it no bleed so we need 0.5 inches from all the border what you're gonna do now is go here and choose a rectangle or you can just press r okay guys and we can go for the corner here and make this 0.5 and as you can see we can change the size of the width from here you can just come here and press 0.5 inches cool and then you can come here control c control v and you take another one here adjust it cool and then another rectangle and also you need it 0.5 from here from the height this time because it's upside down rectangle so 0.5 as you can see height and then again control c control v and take it here down and as you can see now we have the safe areas it it's it means the safe area where we can design or make anything inside so what we're gonna do now is to find the unicorn graphics so how can we find there are a lot of different websites free public domain but to, for today's video we'll go for bixby once you go for bixby you will write unicorn and let's meet uh, let me choose something difficult a little bit not something easy maybe to be better to illustrate okay let's choose this one okay and open it and once we get here we will have to sure that the bixby license is free for commercial use and no attribution required and we will go for free download and we will download we forgot about the png we will go for vector graphic and then download once we download it as you can see here you can just come back to graphic designer cool 
and once we are back in graphic designer you can go and open the download folder so maybe we can say open file of this type okay show in folder and you can get this drag and drop and as you can see it's very easy and once we we have the vector we need just to adjust in the middle okay sorry about that because of the lag okay once we adjust in the middle we need to take all the color from the unicorn so what we can do now is to come here and maybe you can make right click and go for ungroup selection or make shift ctrl g or you can come here and ungroup items you can do whatever you want so now because there are two items there were, first there were one item when you make one time ungroup there are two now everyone is alone as you can see and then you can also ungroup again and group you have to try this several times until you are sure that something like that you can just when you move it it's not moving like together it's moving alone so what i'm gonna make now maybe ungroup like several times because sometimes you have to ungroup until you find like something like that you can you know you can move it it's cool and also here you also can ungroup selections until also you find here is not ungrouped yet because sometimes it takes several times or yeah here we go as you can see you can just select that so now everything is like not grouping together so we can do the filling option so we will take all of that together shift uh, like uh, lift on the mouse and then take all of the unicorn and then go for the fill here in the fill section and choose white and as you can see maybe i can zoom a little bit like 200 so you can see more the only thing that's not a uh, still color is the eye so what you can do now is go here and convert the pointer to sub select or you can press t and then select that and go for the border go down here not the field the border and go and make it black that's why i wanted to choose something a little bit complicated to make sure that everything we can illustrate great so everything now is black everything is fine also you can change the thickness of this border so if you are not if you are if you are not uh, happy with that you can select all up oh. First of all, we go back, as you can see, and select, and then you can go for border, and then instead of 0.5, we can make it 1. So look, look here, when we make it 1, it will be a little bit thicker, as you can see. It's much more thicker now. If you want me to illustrate it more, maybe I will make it 3, and then, as you can see, if you make it 3, it's a little bit so bold, so maybe 1 is, is enough. Okay, and once you are happy, once you are fine everything is good what we're gonna do now here uh, is to make the dot how can we make a dot marker because we need we don't need only current book we know we want to make a dot the dot is literally it's just a circle and the circle doesn't mean to be like uh, uh, like a very big circle or small circle just some circles to to put here and i can show you also on amazon if you go to amazon here where yeah look one of this coloring book it's just easy as you can see the interior they are not even on the inside the the, the the graphic itself another one as you can see can be inside can be outside can be big can be small it doesn't matter at all okay but in my opinion it's better to be inside but it's okay so let's make the dot how can we make it we can just go for here and choose eclipse and do whatever we want maybe we can make it big like that we can make it also another one we can make it small but let's make it like that or we can also adjust the radius from here okay we can make it 0 0.5 for example the radius and now it's 0 0.5 radius you can adjust it as a circle do whatever you want now we want to convert that to a black border and white inside so we will press here and we will make border we will make plus here and then black it will be converted to black border and we want to fill inside white so we'll come here 
and make it white as we can see if you are happy then put this here and just press ctrl c ctrl v and you can have another copy if you want make another ctrl v again and ctrl v ctrl c ctrl v again and you can do whatever you want as you can see and once you finish all the dots here and here and over there once you are happy with everything don't forget guys to delete all of this border because we don't need the border just for our safe side and also the border from here and here don't forget to, to remove that and also if you want to make a new page what you're gonna do here is just come here and create new page like that what you're going what you're gonna do also you can come here which is easier and duplicate the page once you duplicate it you will have the same page again you can just you know you, you can just have the same border and remove these designs and have another unicorn and that's it once you are happy everything is fine and you, you make the dots you downloaded all the graphics and you feel everything once you are happy you will have to export it as a pdf let's see how can we export as a pdf the down section here as you can see guys you will go for the plus section and then you will choose instead of png pdf cool and then you will write maybe you will name it unicorn and choose how many pages and then press here export and once you press export it will be exported as a pdf so guys i hope you enjoyed my video i hope you will subscribe and like my content and also smack the like button and write me down below in the comment section if you want any question i will answer everything and maybe in the next video if you want i will make a cover for this unicorn so stay tuned for the next video hope you like this video guys and see you in the next video bye bye